Hello everyone, Travis here from HelpMyCloud.com. I'm here today with another short video on SuccessFactors LMS. Specifically, we'll be talking about the bookmarking feature as well as the recents feature in the LMS admin tool. On the left-hand side of the page here, you'll see a, red, a yellow star. If you select that, here you'll see the bookmarks as well as the recents. Starting off with the bookmarks, Mostly anything in the system you're able to bookmark, meaning you can flag it as a bookmark and it'll show up in this list. You can also sort into folders. As you can see here, I have this course test one, two, three bookmarked into a folder called courses. To show you how this is done, I'm actually going to go ahead and bookmark my user account. So if I navigate to users, the first selection we have here is users. I search for my first name. And then on the left hand side here, we have that star. So if I select this, I'm going to put my user account in a bookmark. If I want to move the bookmark, I can select here. Right now it's in the root of the bookmarks. However, maybe I want to create a folder to call it users. I can click add folder, call it users, save. And now we have a folder called users. And once I save this, my user account is going to go into that folder, as you can see here. If I change my mind later on, I want to go into the courses folder, I could drag this record here. And now both these records are in the courses folder. And now maybe I don't want the users folder, I can hover over, delete. Would you like to regard? Yes. Another way to bookmark is by navigating directly onto the record. So if I want to bookmark, bookmark another course per se, I can go to learning, defaults to items. I'm just going to do a blank search, select this fourth option here I could have selected the star on the left hand side but maybe I forgot as you can see here in the actions menu we also have a bookmarks button if I select that I'm going to be prompted with the same message this is a course so I do want to save it into the courses folder so I hit save it tells me it's been created great and if you look on the left hand side here now that's sitting in the courses folder maybe I want to reorder drag this above and that's really all it comes down to with bookmarks. You can bookmark anything from a course to an employee, a curriculum. Most things in the system you can bookmark. But hit over here on the recents. This is going to show me anywhere I've been in the system. As you can see here, first I went to test one, two, three. Then I navigated to my user account. And then lastly to the mobile access course. Most things in the system, aside from a handful like uh, content objects, don't go in the recents for some reason. Most things will show here and this will save you a lot of time navigating back and forth to different entities in the system. If you do not have one of these options or the star option altogether, what you have to do is if you have access, navigate to system admin, security, role management, search for your admin role. I'm just going to do a blank search, learning admin, edit, workflows, Add one or more from list and the workflows we're looking for are located under system administration so if i select here you can see here manage bookmarks and view recents aren't selected so if i select them here hit add then okay i now have those added to this admin role this is not the admin role that i'm using because if that was the case i would not have the option over here on the left hand side of the screen